God sells us all things at the price of labor. Quote Leonardo da Vinci. According to the YouTubes. I may or may not make a dollar today or tomorrow. Maybe zero, maybe one, maybe ten. And one thing that I find common in a lot of places, in many places, and I think there's people with the same frequency as me that believe God will sell you everything at the price of labor. You know, people don't say, you know, because I'm black, that's why I didn't get the job. Because of this, because of that. Only the lady. The Shiba, Shiba Inu or Shiba Inu? The crypto coin. <laughs> That's a, another thing with it. <coughs> another thing with that. Um, shout out to Cryptos, George from Cryptos of Rust who uh, stated uh, the greatest trade of all time in the history of mankind. Some dude bet $8,000 on Shiba Inu. I forget the exact date, but I think it was over a year ago. Those $8,000 are not worth, I want to say $3 billion. Because he held on. <laughs> and I was like, what the fuck? Congrats to him, man. I think I think it's a dude I'm guessing. Um, I think it's impressive that this dude now, uh, dude or a group of people, I don't know. But I'm guessing someone who's uh, knowledgeable enough to to buy a, to buy a coin, a digital coin, a crypto coin. Reads a little bit, knows a little bit about investing, business management, creating the business, starting the business, life, and uh, just me taking a, sh a shot in the dark. I'm guessing that uh, he'll be affected with $3 billion. Now, it's up to him to be either Lex Luthor or Batman. Uh, yeah, yeah, he earned it. And I don't know if I could have. And I think this dude is still buying more Shiba. I don't think. Fuck, dude. Uh, wait, what am I thinking? Because I'm sort of thinking about the maths. On one hand, I'll say, yep, I fucked up. I missed out. He, he deserves it, man. Just like uh, many of us deserve where we're at. You know, there is the exception to the rule, right? Where you know, it could be someone out there, a homeless a man who was robbed. You know, a dude who was actually robbed by um, the cops. I think I'll check up on this guy. Uh, it's 
see, see the same business, but he, he ran a successful business in Orange County and uh, constantly like uh, his operations sort of a um, illegally and tactfully arrested him and um, put him under arrest. I don't know which police department or sheriff's department specifically uh, set him up. I heard the story years ago and uh, he was living out of his van selling, selling goods, selling um, what he could with his uh, business license. Yeah, but that's the dude who, uh, yeah, just running a business, a, a legit business. I'm glad that marijuana's legal now too because I don't know how many less people are in jail for it. For shit that I don't give a fuck about, you know? Like, you know, if you're drunk or high on the sidewalk, <laughs> which which is almost, 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 just about almost a fucking daily experience for me, I'll find someone high or drunk on the sidewalk. Or mentally ill, mentally ill. You know, but we can't make money off those mentally ill people, you know, so fuck them, leave them alone. And those red pencils finally about to die. They're so dangerous. But, um, yeah, we, we deserve our, um, our place in life. We've earned it, man. We have earned it. You know, one thing that that's gone to me well, one thing that really gets me was uh, you know, just yesterday's uh, today's Thursday, I think so two more days. So the today, today and tomorrow are days where. Now correct me if I'm wrong. The anniversary of the Great Depression and the anniversary of the two thousand eight financial collapse, collapse or giant hiccup. Because it wasn't a real collapse because <coughs> a lot of these corrupt businesses are still still open. You got bailed out your dollars in the um, with American Amer America's money Americans money America's money Americans money to uh, keep buying the CEOs their jets their whores their cocaine their pedophilia their tigers your drinking habits, your gambling habits, all this shit. I remember when George Carlin said, you know, it's a big fucking club and you ain't in it. Now, I can't prove uh, exactly who's a child rapist, a drunk, a co cocaine head, sane worshiper. But I wouldn't doubt that some of these motherfuckers are just dirty like that. I think it's like the off Jeffrey Epstein. He knew too much and he was catching too much heat. But he was merely a, a connect, he wasn't the, the I really doubt that all that shit's over. It was just the, uh, I want to say the, was it the car salesman? Yeah, the car salesman. Not the fleet manager, car fleet manager. Uh, side distraction here. I remember when uh, the son of Sam, David, David Berkowitz, when he said how 
he admitted to two of the shootings, but he, he says he was identified two of the shootings, but he couldn't have been in all the other places with multiple with different witnesses, multiple different witnesses and, and different descriptions. But that even in prison, he still um, feared retaliation, so he doesn't speak about things like that. Such a creepy old man who uh, he just is destructive out there. All sorts of things are happening in the world right now. Economy are crashing, China's crashing. Hey, but people say, oh, turn the music up, you just. No, no, fuck bitches. Let's get high, let's get drunk. Not my problem. When I, when I heard that quote about Leonardo da Vinci, that God sells everything at the, at the price or at the cost of labor, I like that a lot because, you know, I'm working on this right now. At the moment, no one is paying me to do this. No one. And I got other projects on the side that I'm working on. And also, no one has hired me for those jobs. No commission, no, no for sure sale. Um, no guaranteed customers. Zero percent guarantee. But as you can see, how many videos I've done on this piece that I just filled this in with black or stars. I think I throw a couple stars in here as tiny fillers. But I want this. Uh, I want this piece rich. Rich. I get one customer, a lot of customers. Good man. But but there'll be people that say, "Mom, man, you're lucky, man. Oh, look, man, you got you got forty dollars. Let me twenty. You got two twenty. You want? Let me one. I need it." And, uh, Yeah, it's, it's a gut check, man, because you know, to think where where I've come from and what I've done uh, to be here, or to still, still be here. Um, I think I, sh I should Technically, my odds is that I should be overdosed, dead and overdosed, homeless, or an average best case scenario, married uh, to some chick who's now fat, obese, obese, hating life, working on Monday, 9 to 5, raising kids, not raising a family. Staring out, uh, out in the traffic, out a window, down the street, up in the sky, and wondering, what if? What if? Could have been a contender. Could have been somebody. 
goddamn that just something something in my belly something in my gut something in the back of my mind something in my heart just said no just go try this and i've uh, i failed at that many 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 things uh, no doubt i've had way more failures than i've had wins but the wins that i've had have been some well, some pretty cool ones you know and as i was saying to someone yesterday you know you know that my skill level right now i'm very un unhappy with it <clears throat> to the point that i've got to um improve it add more detail more color more saturation and that comes with practice and study and i just get it done that's it just get it done man. See right here, I put a little bit too much white in there. But, um, or right even right here, it smeared the red a bit. But no, we'll, we'll roll with it, man. We'll roll with it. Even thinking right now about future problems that I have, with with some success that I'll have, should I succeed in these certain things, certain endeavors, and that's okay, man. It's not complaining. And if anything, I know how people are, so I'm thinking, oh, I think this won't happen, so let me prepare for it. But yeah, man, much as possible, man. God, the universe, Allah, genie in the bottle. Barbara Streisand. I just do it. Don't, don't give me what you want for labor or for the correct price. But mostly, I, I just think it is labor. Or about to get into the market. And, uh, Get it done, man. Trump 2024. Remember, there are no easy days. See through days where potential is not fulfilled. And when going gets tough, let's go, bite.